In this video, I will demonstrate how to create a terrain model from XYZ data. So I'm in the Open Roads Modeling Workflow, the Terrain tab, Create. I'm going to go under Additional Methods, and I'll select Create Terrain Model from ASCII File. Now I can open up my CSV that contains the XYZ data and click Done. And then now I can come up here to my text import settings and I can set it or I can also do it right here as well. So I'll go up here and just follow through the prompts. So this is first the file formatting. I want it to start on the first line and end just at the very last line. The decimal separator is a point, so I'll hit next. And this is delimited with a comma, so I'll select comma. And then now you can see that it's broken it up into three columns. So from here, I can select the northing, the easting, and the elevation. These are all spot features. And then you can set up the feature symbology if you want. So I'll click Next. And you can see it filling it all out. Next. If you need to set up the coordinate system that's associated with your data, you can do this here and click Finish. And then you can go out and save that text import wizard settings. Okay, so now you can see it updated it right here to point to the one that we just created. You can assign a feature definition to how you want the terrain to look. I'll do terrain existing triangles. You can do the different triangulation options, set a coordinate system, and then when you have all your settings, you just click import. Now that it's done, I'll exit out and do a fit view, and you can see it right here. So it could be for this terrain, I probably am going to want a specific edge method. So I can come back here, change it to sliver, and it gets it down even more. Or I could add a boundary, or I could do something like a max edge length and set it to something like 50, and it'll remove everything a little bit better.